you're back welcome to my channel i got a pimple oh well quarantine oh well i break out nobody gotta see it you feel me but you know i ain't got nothing else going on nowhere else so it's cool okay so today's video is going to be a get to know me um i'm new to youtube fairly kind of sort of well not really new but kind of new no, whatever but anyway so this video is going to be a get to know me some things about me some quick little things about me and then you know you're going to get to know me as my channel grow so let's get into it you gotta subscribe first oh, okay i'm looking at it through my other phone because i wrote some things down um that people ask or you know common things that people get to know people as whatever first thing my real name and my nicknames my real name is Quatisha, but nicknames i go by you know my family calls me kwa kwa my friends call me kwa um i'm also a dancer so i go by mia more my rap name is also mia more so i go by mia more or mimi or mia or one of my friends call me just m so i have a ton of names my boyfriend's family call me tt so i have like a ton of nicknames like you can call me what you want but you cannot call me ugly birthday and age i am a libra my birthday is october 12th and i am 24 years old i am a new york girl i was born in brooklyn but i grew up in queens i've lived in queens like basically from half my life till now like i'm a queens girl i rep queens that's it south side jamaica new york city to the death of me favorite color my favorite color is pink pink everything i love pink so much like i've never had another favorite color um it's just straight pink pink or nothing like i love pink like i just think it's such a pretty color um it's so cute like anything pink like i just i love it so much favorite food <gasps> oh my gosh I am a taco girl. I love tacos. I love all type of tacos. Mexican tacos, American tacos, shrimp tacos, chicken tacos, beef tacos, <sighs> cereal tacos, spaghetti tacos, fish tacos, jerk chicken tacos, any type of taco. I love it. I love oatmeal. I almost got into a fight at Dunkin' Donuts over some oatmeal. Me and the employee, she told me she couldn't warm my oatmeal and almond milk like girl. I come to Dunkin' Donuts every night and I get the same thing. Why can't you do it tonight? Like, um, my favorite meal meal, like if I had to put everything together, would definitely be fried chicken, macaroni and cheese, and sweet potatoes. Wow, it's amazing. Favorite sport? Hmm. See, when I was younger, I used to love football, but I still like football, but you know, um, I'm more of a basketball girl like once I got to junior high school I started to love basketball more and I was actually on the basketball team and I sucked I sucked dearly like no points no nothing my favorite music genre or artist <laughs> although I am a rapper I love R&B like I am a sucker for love songs like you cannot have me DJ in a car with a bunch of people because they're going to be depressed. They're going to want to call their ex. They're going to be all sprung. I'm, you know, I like trap music here and there, but I am an R&B type of girl. So, I don't know. People always ask me, how can you be a rapper if you like R&B? And I really don't know. Hmm. Hmm. But anyway, my favorite artist... Is that a serious question? Nicki Minaj. Like, everybody knows that. I love Nicki to death. Like, she can do no wrong in my eyes. Like, she could set a building on fire. I can see her set the building on fire. And I'm going to be like, nah, she ain't do that. She ain't do that shit. I love Nicki so much. That's the art. You know what they say? Like, what's the artist you'll go to jail behind or you'll fight behind? And it's definitely Nicki because... 
I love her so, 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 so much. Instruments. I played instruments in life. Like when I was in the third grade, I played the violin. And from the fourth to sixth grade, I played the saxophone, the soprano saxophone. And when I was in high school, 11th and 12th grade, I played the piano. I have three favorite movies. <clears throat> Number one and two. These two kind of got a tie. Matilda and Jumanji. Like, those are my all-time favorite movies since I was a kid. I can watch those to this day. I love them so much. The Jumanji, I love the remakes. They are so hilarious. Those are my top two movies. And then, of course, the third, Dream Girls. I love Dream Girls. That is such, such a classic. And I am telling you I'm not going Hobbies or special skills? Well, rapping, I guess, is a hobby and a special skill because, you know, a lot of people can't do it. A lot of people is doing it, but they can't do it. So that's a special skill. And it takes a lot to actually write and produce something really good. Like, a lot of people write and it'd be bullshit. So that's a special skill for me. I also know how to crochet and knit. Um, I don't really know. That's something to think about. Hmm. Hmm. But anything you can do, I can do better. I can do anything better than you. Think about that. Because if you think you got a special skill, I'm probably better than you at it. Fears. Oh my God. I'm scared of planes. My fear of planes is just like... It's, it's just beyond me like I'm also not really scared when people drive fast but I have anxiety when people drive really fast because I got into a car accident it wasn't due to speeding but it just makes me think like you know anything can happen so I have a fear when people drive fast I don't like it it's, it's not even cute like why are you in a rush where are you in a rush to go like you don't want to be in a car with me you you trying to get home quick like why are you speeding for do i have any tattoos yes i do have a tattoo i have a tattoo right here on my neck it's a palm tree it used to be really small and then i got it covered i have a tattoo on my shin sheen however you say it. it's a big um indian if you follow me on instagram you know you can see my leg and you can see my bomb tattoo actually let me try to i got on leggings so let me try to lift it nah my leg is ashy so forget it you just gotta follow me on Instagram and you can see it. Or I could just insert a picture. I also have a butterfly on my belly. You guys probably saw my butterfly if you watch my BBL video. Saw my butterfly on my belly. That was my first tattoo and I got it when I was 16 years old. Round of applause. I graduated high school, went to college. I was the first of my family to do so. So that was like a big accomplishment for me. Um, not, not only did I graduate high school, I graduated out of 400 students, 400 seniors. I graduated, my rank was number 12. So that's a lot. Like, I'm really smart. And a lot of people don't know that about me. Like, my GPA was, what was my GPA? I don't know, like a 3.8 or something in high school. 3.6, 3.8, I don't remember. But I was really smart in high school. I'm still really smart, but you know what I mean. Like, in high school, I was on my A game. Like, you know, I was the go-to person when people wanted to cheat on their tests or cheat on their girlfriend. No, nah, I'm just kidding. But anyway, yeah, I was the go-to person. So, you know, I'm a smart girl. Pet peeves. What are my pet peeves? One of my pet peeves is... If I go to your house and you have a ton of sneakers and your sneakers are not in the box, they're just on top of the box. I hate that. Like that drives me nuts because those boxes are taking up space and you have the sneaker and you still have the box. So why is the sneaker not in the box? Like it just don't make no sense to me. Hmm. Hmm. What don't I like? What don't I like? It goes for my YouTube channel. First of all, I never in a million years would have thought that I would be here making YouTube videos. Okay. But I never thought I would be here making YouTube videos because, like, I know people were getting paid through YouTube. I just never thought that, you know, it would be me because... 
I never thought to take YouTube serious. You know, I would just come here and I would post my music videos and and just go. Like, you know, that was just that was just it. But um after I had my surgery, my BBL and I made my BBL video, it just went off. Like I only expected a thousand views, like literally like a thousand and all right, we go on. But it was like literally growing overnight. Like in one day it had like 300 views and then like literally the next day it had a thousand and then it went to three thousand five thousand and then it kept going up and i was just like oh my god and then you know people started subscribing to me and i was getting like a hundred subscribers a week off that video and now here i am i have like 1100 subscribers now that's not a lot but i got it off that one video and i got all my watch hours you know you need four thousand watch hours to monetize your channel and i got it all off that one video so that was like crazy like that was crazy to me and i want to thank you guys so much for that because it's just like a lot of people have been on youtube for a while and they haven't reached that mark yet i mean i've been on youtube since 2009 but i never really did anything with my channel as far as vlogging or anything like that but whatever thank you guys so much but some of my goals for this channel is to do like girly stuff you know I want to do try on hauls, you know, since I have surgery. I really haven't really gotten dressed up cute and stuff since I had my surgery. So I kind of want to do that. I want to order some cute clothes because, you know, I'm kind of a tomboy. I don't have girly cute clothes. I want to do food critic videos. I want to go out. I want to compare restaurants. I want to say what I like and dislike about this restaurant. I want to do, you know, things like that. I want to do like hair things, hair treatments because I'm a natural and I want to give girls some tips. I would like to do wig videos because I know how to make wigs and I know how to bleach and pluck nuts. So I want to give um, information on that as well. But thank you for subscribing to me. And if you are not subscribed, you need to do that right now before you even watch anymore. Basically, right now I'm in school for um, to become an esthetician. I would like to finish school. I would like to go back to regular school. I have two classes before I can graduate and get my degree. So I would like to do that. I would like to finish esthetician school, become an esthetician, um, focus on my music, go hard with that. I would like to stop dancing. Like I would like to start a lip. Hold on. I would like to start a lip gloss line um this year actually that's that's like my 2020 goals i would like to start a lip gloss line you know venture out into some other things that i didn't even know that i can do like i'm really trying to explore and push myself to the limit so that is like my main thing right now i've been to miami like so many times i've been to alabama i've been to atlanta i've only been out the country one time i've been to cancun like i don't really like flying but i do want to travel um I want to go to Australia like that has been on my um go-to list for like ever I want to go to Ar Australia I want to go to Switzerland I want to go to um the Bahamas and I would like to go to Jamaica those are like the four top places and Egypt those are like the five top places that I really want to travel to um before I kick the bucket so I'm going to try to make that happen between this year and next year okay so that pretty much sums it up little things that there is to get to know me if in the future you guys feel like you want to know anything else about me i can also do a q a video and we can go from there you know because i'm new to this and you guys are new to my channel so we can just grow together thanks for watching come again tell a friend to subscribe